Hi everyone! In this video, I thought I would show you a project that I built a few years ago. This is an excessively large pendulum wave. This series of pendulums is carefully measured so that each one, as we move backward from the first, swings exactly one more time than the pendulum in front of it over a period of 90 seconds. This forms a curve that is determined by an algebraic equation, and when the pendulums are set swinging, different patterns begin to emerge a visual representation of math interacting with the real world. In an earlier video, I went over the equation used to figure out how to measure each of these pendulums, which I'll link to in the video description below. If you'd like to build one of these, but you're not really interested in the math, these are the measurements I calculated to determine the length of each pendulum in this series. In my case, I'm only using the first 20 numbers on this list, starting with a pendulum of 1 meter in length but I calculated this series out to 60 places so that you at home would have the option to make a smaller pendulum wave by starting with one of the measurements in the middle. This is how long each of the pendulum should be from the pivot point to the center of mass, which if you ignore the small weight of the string is right about here in the middle of each nut. The heavier these are, the better. Well, for the best effect, these pendulums all need to be set swinging at exactly the same time. So to get this accomplished, I have a board with a few handles I've screwed into it so I can hold onto it easily. So let's get these swinging and watch the series from start to finish. Jeez, Mose. 
This video is sponsored by The Great Courses Plus, which is a subscription-based educational video website with lectures and courses from universities, organizations, and experts on a wide variety of subjects. Now, when I'm considering taking on a new sponsor like The Great Courses Plus, I really dig into what they have to offer to make sure I can endorse them wholeheartedly. The first thing I noticed scrolling through the Great Courses Plus homepage was the wide variety of topics. There's lots of courses on science, history, and practical skills like cooking. But the one that caught my eye and totally sold me on the sponsorship is the Masters of Photography course presented by National Geographic. This course is awesome. It's presented by National Geographic photographers that talk about their techniques, not only the technical aspects of photography, but how to use images for storytelling. Video and photography go hand in hand, so this was a very compelling course to apply to my own projects. The first video in the series talks about how sometimes the best images come during moments of discomfort, when the last thing you want to do is take out your camera, which I experienced firsthand filming this project. Late at night, as I was just about to call it quits, I had the idea to film my pendulum under black light. And being tired and careless, I cut my hand, almost down to the bone. But after patching myself up, I pushed through while the inspiration was fresh and got what I think turned out to be the best shots of the video. The Masters of Photography course is all available through a free trial of The Great Courses Plus, which you can access through my link, thegreatcoursesplus.com forward slash Nighthawk, or by clicking the shortened link in the video description below. Thank you everyone for watching this video, and I'll see you next time. Well done, Moe's. I think we got it. Ha, ha, ha.